long-term impacts on our school system and the economy. And that's why happening today, the Greater Phoenix Economic Council is holding a special webinar. Jamie Warren is live with more about this event that's touching on both the future of our education system and our economy. Jamie, there, there's so much connection between the two. Yeah, Nick, since this pandemic started, Greater Phoenix has done over a dozen of these webinars looking into the different industries that have been impacted the most by COVID-19. They say the top industry that has been impacted is the hospitality industry. However, the CEO of Greater Phoenix, Chris Camacho, says that things have gone up slightly. He says most hotels in our region are about 40 to 50 percent full, which is better than where we were in in April, but they'd like to see those numbers in the 60 to 70% range. He says until people feel safe to get on an airplane, hotels and other recreational activities will continue to struggle throughout the past few weeks. They've been exploring how to overcome that. But among the many industries being discussed in this series, today's will be about education. And Camacho says the pandemic will forever change how students are taught. It's also uh, shown nationally of this digital digital divide that exists and how some of the, the low income communities don't have the access uh, at home to whether it's computers or laptops or tablets as well as internet service. And so, you know, we are we're working with the education community and the, the telecom companies on how do we address that. So today's webinar will be posted on their YouTube page. You just have to search for Greater Phoenix. And as for the next topic they'll be exploring, they say it'll be about the future of sports. For now, we're live in Phoenix. I'm Jamie Warren, ABC 15 Arizona.